Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am headed to Seoul this weekend because my husband has some friends that are coming in um, from the States to visit him. So we're gonna hang out and enjoy the weekend together. We're gonna be getting into a lot. So of course, it's perfect time to make a video. I also have um, my dance shoes with me because I plan to go salsa dancing. And of course, when I do that, I'm going to vlog for you guys so you can see what some salsa dancing is like in Seoul. I'll be going to Gangnam, a place called Turn. I think it's like the oldest um, salsa club in Korea, I think. So I'm going to check that out. Haven't been there in years, of course. So it'll be nice to revisit and just to vlog and be a tourist. So enjoy. Um, it's cute. It's really like really close in the, exactly in the heart of Itaewon area. It's called Itaewon Inn. It's like down a block from um, the Itaewon train station. So super convenient. The plan for us for today is to go to Dongdaemu Market, get some Korean style dinner, do shopping, some sightseeing, some people watching, and then for nightlife, I'm gonna go salsa dancing. Um, and then I think they either might come along with me or they might like explore some other aspects of some downtown life. So I'll give you a tour of my um, hotel room. This is like the bedroom area. It's super basic. Um, I like that we have a window, a little coat rack, a TV, which I almost likely never use. And then like a little table. Our bathroom, that's me, <laughs> super basic. Um, maybe this might um, skeeve you out a little bit, but this is a bathroom. You probably definitely want um, to have something on your feet when you're in here, but I guess it's something basic in the heart of downtown to get the job done. So let's head over to the map, and I'll show you the route to that we are looking to take today, but of course anything will change because it's just us exploring today and getting lost and just doing touristy stuff. So one thing about me is that I love maps. Um, so I'm always picking them up wherever I go. So we came from Seoul Station, because that's where they came in, using the airport train, and now we're here at Itaewon. We want to go up here to Dongdae Moon. Seems like a really simple shot. Um, taking one train up a few stops and then over one. And then later on, this is where I'm headed. Gone now for some salsa. A really full day. We walked around Donde Moon, did lots of haggling, they bought a few stuff, we ate some knickknacks, ate dinner at two different locations. We had barbecue and then we went somewhere else and then we had uh, tacos. And you know, normally I'm all for traditional Korean food, but being here in Itaewon, like you're you have everything accessible to you, and I don't really have this many this much access to um, foreign foods, um, foods that I'm used to. So it was nice to kind of 
eat some really good food that I remember from back home. Day two here in Seoul. I decided to wake up um, and walk around and look for breakfast. I'm not on the main street though. I'm like down in the cut somewhere and I stumbled upon this little cafe. So I ordered a bagel with cream cheese and I'm hoping because it's Itaewon and there's a lot of foreigners here, like it's a real bagel. <laughs> so um, instead of a coffee, I got a chestnut latte only because I haven't seen a chestnut latte here. And I figured since I just came from the chestnut festival, a few weeks ago that it'll be cool to see what a chestnut latte tastes like. So I'm gonna eat breakfast, and then I'm gonna walk around a little bit. Um, I noticed like there's an antique festival happening here. I just keep running into festivals. So there's an antique festival happening here that I'm gonna check out. Everyone has their um, tables set up on the street and all their stuff like out for sale and stuff. So it'll be cool to check that out as well and then clubbing later tonight, so it should be another full day. This is a real size bagel, y'all. I'm so happy. breakfast I went back um, to my hotel room and just crashed because I was exhausted. Woke up and went right back to that taco place as you can see to order the same exact thing because it was so good last night. And now I think I'm going to go back to the hotel room and we're just going to chill out. They're still really tired jet lag. It's like catching up to them. So we're gonna chill out until my husband comes and then we're going to um, check out like the nightlife and stuff. So I've just been chilling, checking out the antique market and just relaxing. So it's been a really nice low-key weekend. 